Hey there, welcome back. I have an ipsy of May to do. It is so pretty out right now. It is gonna be 80 degrees tomorrow. It snowed a couple weeks ago, so <laughs> I'm happy with this weather. I'm going swimming for the first time tomorrow. I'm so stoked for the summer. I'm thinking this month is probably gonna be something summer related. Last month was like more of being natural and being yourself, and while I still obviously want that to continue because not wearing makeup much at all this entire past year since like last March. I'm really wanting some like sunscreen type stuff though and maybe something for oil because <laughs> I work in a school and one of the math teachers has two little girls and they always like hang out by my office because I have some like fun things in my office to play with little uh, things that distract kids and um, one of them yesterday asked if my um why I was sweating and I was like that is not sweat that is I am just a grease ball it's a smaller box than normal so it's not very heavy either I don't no I never peek ahead of time I, I love that surprise so it's going to definitely be a still a surprise so flower power the brightest blooms come after the storm and now it's time to thrive go wild with color Flex your glowy skin know-how and let your show-stopping beauty come alive. Now I do have glowy skin. Okay, so the theme sounds colorful. The first thing we're going to pull out, and I'll show you right inside the box. This is what it looks like. We're going to do the glam bag first, because we always do. And I'm a creature of habit. It's a very pretty floral bag and a rose gold zipper. The first thing I'm pulling out is a Anastasia, Anastasia Beverly Hills lipstick, I think. Ooh, that's pretty. It's like a mauvey brown. I don't have any lip color that looks like this, so I'm hyped for that. The next thing is by, oh, it's a full-size tart. Sometimes you get full size in the Ipsy Glam bag, and this is one of them. I love Tarte, and this is in the color Rose. It's very, like, neutral, friendly. This is such a cool package. What? Okay, so how does... How do you twist it up? Juicy lip. I'm assuming it's, like, not full. Oh, you... Oh, my battery died. Um, but you click it up. That is so freaking cool. I've never seen a click lip gloss or lipstick. Hello. That is, that actually looks like my lip color. Like that looks exactly like my lips. So let's go ahead and put that on. I actually love the fact that I wouldn't even have to look in a mirror to do this because no matter how much or little I get on it, because it does blend in so much, it will look nice. Mm, that is very like buttery feeling. It's not sticky and it's not like, sometimes it can get too slick to where it's like, am I just like rubbing grease on my lips? That feels really nice. I love that. That is going to be hard to beat. I have never even seen this product. I am not up to date on like new things in the stores. Okay, we have Olaplex Hair Perfector number three. This repairs and strengthens all hair types. I want to say I have a little shampoo and conditioner of this I got from Sephora and I have never used it. But this is a bond builder. So you use it before shampooing. I'll have to try that. I haven't used the sample size shampoo and conditioner yet. It'll be nice using the entire set with it. Good, good, good bag so far. Okay, by Avant, this is the Pro Collagen. And I'm not even gonna attempt to say the rest of the words on here. It's a Pro Perfecting Collagen Primer. And what does that mean? You apply to clean, dry skin, wear alone or under foundation to create a smooth, even... Oh, it's a actual, like, makeup primer. I was thinking this was for your hair. Okay, so you can use it with or without makeup. And it's supposed to 
smooth out your skin so that's one thing i don't usually wear our primers so i'm curious how this will end up working for me especially with not wearing makeup i wonder how nice that will make my skin look maybe i should have been using a primer all along and then the last thing is by gold fadden md pure start gentle defox defox detoxifying facial cleanser so a little face cleanser I have a ton, so I'll probably just put this in my giveaway to my students section, but this would be nice to put in like a traveling bag if you were traveling. I have some of those to-go containers though. Okay, so ooh, that was everything in my Ipsy Glam bag. Definitely way more than the 10 or $12 that this is. Uh, the, I mean, this alone had to have been 17 to $24. I loved it. Okay, moving on. We have the Glam Bag Plus now. So that one is a little more than twice as much, but it's all full-size products. So I don't know how you can say no, no to like this one. I don't know how you can say no to the Glam Bag because I've always been obsessed with them, but like this value is crazy what they do in here. Okay, let's just Oh, ooh, milk, ooh, milk make, uh, what? The Kush Mascara, I saw this on Sephora and I was actually really intrigued by it. So this is in the color Boom, which I'm hoping is black. I bought a bunch of little um, trial, not trial, like throwaway mascara things because I have that like icy sty issue. So if I wanna use a nice mascara, why is this so heavy? Um, I can, and I don't have to obviously throw it away if I get a sty. So this literally feels like it's a half a pound. That's so heavy. The packaging is really hefty. So this is, I don't know, it doesn't say black necessarily. I don't really want to open it, but I will, because I'm going to show you guys the wand. It is black. The wand is very, very thick. It's gonna be hard to beat this. I love milk makeup. Okay, next is by Kinship. This is a probiotic moisturizing sunscreen, SPF 32. I'm okay with that. I mean, I love my 50 plus, but I think I'm okay with 32. Sometimes when they're like 15, I'm like, is that really like gonna help me? Cause I do, I do, I'm a little red right now. I do get burned. <laughs> Is this for my face though? I hope it is. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's safe on blemish prone skin. So that's mine. It helps support clear skin. And I've been needing a new face sunscreen. So this is actually perfect timing, especially since I'm going to the pool tomorrow. It will 100% be on my face. Next we have Hey Honey Open Your Eyes Lifting Eye Serum. I'm very excited because I just went through one. My empties is going to be huge. I have went through so much stuff the last couple months. So tighten skin and reduce puffiness. I've been noticing fine lines on my eyes. Obviously my forehead too and I always have laugh lines. But um, my eye ones are, well my forehead ones probably are bothering me the most. I don't think you can see them right now, but you can see how greasy my face is. Uh, but my eye ones, I need something to fix them. Is this last? No. Second to last, we have Fenty. Wait, wait. Okay, I was going to say, I literally just bought it. I thought it was something I just bought. I'm like, dang it. Um, this is an eye pencil called a fly pencil, and it's black. You know, for as much as I said let's show your colors this month they have been giving us very neutral things which i am all about but i was definitely expecting more colorful uh anything really and there's like no color in here there is one product left and i don't know what it is though um i honestly wouldn't have rather had any other color other than black so that those words make sense a black would have been the one i preferred the most i would have been fine with like brown Really, I would have been fine with any of them, but like this is definitely the best one I could have received. So I'm happy with this. I just like, you know, by that card expected something different. 
this might be a favorite actually because I have been needing a new eyeliner and that one's a cool eyeliner so it's not going to tug on my eyes and I really appreciate that. Um, okay, lastly, is this a brush? By Complex Culture, we're making things easier, one eco-friendly product at a time, starting with this brush. This is a fancy package, and it even has a uh, sticker on top that you have to rip through. This is called the Easy Crease Definer, by the way, before I ruin this beautiful packaging. I'm gonna have to do a brush declutter because they have given me so many beautiful brushes and I can't use them all, so I'm gonna get rid of my old ones and use the new ones. This reminds me of a paintbrush. <laughs> I don't, I definitely don't have a brush that's like this. This is so luxurious feeling. It has like a rubberized tip on it. It's just a pretty brush in general. Um, I'm, but it feels like a, like I wanna paint with this. <laughs> I think I might use some of my brushes for painting, actually. Like, maybe that's how I can recycle them. I don't know. Like, have you guys ever used a brush quite like... It's a little stiff. It's a crease brush. I just feel like my other crease brushes don't look like this. But it, it definitely would blend. And then, lastly, comes the bag, which, again, is always a replica of the glam bag so that was everything favorite from glam bag plus is going to the fenty eyeliner i love fenty uh rihanna does a really good job i really want to try selena's line there but again i have not been buying any makeup so wonder if she does any skincare does rihanna do skincare i'll have to check that out i have not been on the site in a long time okay so so that's everything. I'm gonna go shower and then, um, on, I mean, honestly, I'm gonna open up a bottle of wine and uh, my boyfriend's making pizza and we'll watch a movie. So it's gonna be lazy for the rest of the night and I'm okay with that. Let me know in the comments below if you got any, what your favorite thing, if you got a glam bag was, if it was different than like what I got because they are very different. Um, and then leave me in the comments below also what your favorite thing you're looking forward to this summer is. I think mine is definitely being on the lake again. I hope that I get a lot of lake time. I spent a lot of it last year on the lake, so fingers crossed that happens. Okay, I love you so much. Talk to you soon. Bye.